What's up, gender blenders? Um, this will be my first video. Um, this is week 121. Um, but before I do the topic, um, all you are like, what the hell is this? Um, I'm the new guy. Um, I asked to be part of this group because I just think it's a really cool um, community and I've always wanted to be part of some kind of collab channel on YouTube um, and I'll explain that when I talk about the topic because it kind of goes into that um, but first I guess an intro um, like I said my name is Chris I'm uh, 22 I know I don't look like it <laughs> um, so I'm female to male, um, transgendered, and I'm not on anything right now, uh, just, a pretty pre-op, hopefully I'll be, um, getting my top surgery by the end of this year, if not by early next year, um, anyway, mostly I've just been, uh, natural transitioning, a lot of workout and um, a lot of supplements and just eating healthy. Um, I'm getting more into it now, so I can't wait to see those kind of results. But um, yeah, I'm uh, of Latino descent. I was born in Colombia. I go to Santa Monica College in Los Angeles, California. Um, I'm studying to be a psychologist, and hopefully I can transfer to UCLA, but we'll see. Um, by the way, I'm your Saturday guy, <laughs> so I'm going to be uploading my videos on Saturday. Um, and yeah, hopefully I don't disappoint. <laughs> if I do, let me know. Let me know how I can change things, make it better, so that you enjoy it. Um, but yeah. Thank you for allowing me to, allowing me to be your new um, guy in gender blenders. Uh, so week 121 is did or do you have a mentor for transitioning? Um, someone that helped you along, answered questions, or was there for support either off or on the web? I think or support. I've had a lot of support. And I think support for anyone, but especially um, people who are transitioning and who have this to deal with, it's really important to have somebody there to um, to kind of hold your hand and have a shoulder to lean on. Because I know without a couple of these people that I'm going to mention, I, I would be falling apart. I don't even know um, where I would be, so... First thing I'm going to mention, the biggest support, biggest mentor, biggest um, anything that has helped me get um, get through all my hard times with transitioning um, has got to be God. And even though right now I'm kind of in a little bit of a dry spell with uh, my, my relationship with God, um, He's still always there. I guess just reading the Bible and um, and all that stuff has helped me really understand myself more and has helped me love myself a lot more. Um, so, yeah, definitely the biggest would be God. And with that goes my my church. My, when I go to this small group where we study the Bible and afterwards we break up into groups and we share um, prayer requests. And we just kind of talk about how our day's been and and all that stuff and ask for them to pray for us. And I told them about my wanting to transition and uh, what was going on um, with me and all that. And I was really scared to come out to them because, you know, the, the stereotype that religious people are just not going to understand you and that they're, they're just going to judge you. Um, even though I know the people in those groups very well. Um, I still had that feeling that maybe they could, they could turn their backs on me, but, um, God is good, and I told them, and they were totally okay with it, um, I don't know if they think that it's right, but they didn't, 
they didn't say that to me. They basically said, you know, have your relationship with God, talk to him and see what he wants you to do and just keep searching him. Um, so they've been a great support to be able to tell them how I'm feeling and have them pray over me. And, and um, yeah, I just, I really love the support that they give me. Um, okay, and besides that, that's offline, obviously. <laughs> On the web, YouTube, of course. And this is the reason why I wanted to be in a collab channel. Uh, I started looking at YouTube videos maybe four years ago. Um, and just seeing these guys that were going through exactly the same thing that I was going to, through and I didn't know about, that there was a name or anything. Just, like, I don't know. It was such a relief to see somebody, like, going through the same thing because it wasn't just me, you know? Like, I wasn't making it up. And I started talking to some of these guys online or just watching all their videos and just through them and seeing their hardships and seeing how they came out of them. That that was support enough, um, whether it was indirect or just by me watching their film, their videos. That was um, big support. Um, my parents, my parents, I, t I came out to them a while ago, and even though they still don't use male pronouns, um, they are really supportive. They basically told me, as long as you're healthy and happy, do whatever you want, because that's what we want for you. Um, and they're so loving, and even though I know it's, it's hard on them, um, especially on my mom, you can tell, she won't, she won't tell me that it's hard, she'll just tell me that she's here for me, and if I want to talk about anything, um, that she's there, I guess my, my new, kind of new friend, Nico, um, I wouldn't say he's a mentor, but he's definitely somebody that has helped me, um, be more comfortable with myself uh, because he's the first trans guy that I know in real life and that I hang out with in real life. Um, so it's just a really awesome bond that we have. Like we go and work out and just vibe off each other and ask each other questions. And um, it's just really awesome to have somebody there in real life that you can connect with in that kind of level, you know, um, people that aren't transgendered, you know, their support is awesome too, and I, I wouldn't be here without them, but, um, having somebody that's going through exactly the same thing in just different ways, um, in my everyday life is, is pretty awesome. Um... I guess mentors that are kind of out more in the media or things like that. Um, Jameson Green is a mentor to me because look him up. Like, that's all I need to say. Just look him up. He's just an inspiration to the whole trans community um, as a whole. And um, his book, uh, Becoming a Visible Man, I had it in my hands for a couple of days and I read like 10, of, 10 pages from his book. And those 10 pages, I learned more than what I learned in four years of looking up staff, stuff about transgendered people and just society in general and how it's put into a binary system and stuff like that. Um, so he's definitely a mentor. And um, so I look forward to learning more about him so that I can learn more about me. <laughs> and... Uh, Hmm. I think that's it. <sighs> Excuse me. This video is so long. Alright, so that was week 121. Um, it's nice to meet y'all. And, um,. If you have any questions for me, if you want me to share anything else about myself, let me know and I'll put it in the next video. Um, but yeah, thanks again and hope you got a good Saturday, guys. Peace.